Okay, today's video. Check dirt here. Okay, today's video is going to feature uh, Guitar Player Magazine from October of 1984 on the cover. Get that hand off. On the cover is Steve Ray Vaughan. And uh, the way I discovered Steve Ray Vaughan is uh, when I first saw him on PBS, he was performing on Austin City Limits. And I just remember, you know, turning on the channel, seeing this guy um, wearing this, what was it, like a blue, long kind of a, I don't know if a shirt or like a robe or something, but it, I just, I don't know, it caught my attention. And then it, when he started playing, I couldn't believe that uh, I just liked the sound of his guitar playing. And um, I wasn't a big blues fan at the time. I really didn't listen to blues. It was more rock. But ever since I saw Steve Ray Vaughan, I became a blues fan and uh, started to uh, practice more blues and he really made me a big fan and I was sad when he passed away. Um, but his music lives on and he has legions of fans still. So let's check out this issue of Guitar Player Magazine, October of 84. 250, you could have bought this back in 84. <clears throat> Here's the ad. For Ibanez, still a great guitar company. Was that Missing Persons? Oh yeah. Carvin, Carvin, who is now what the Kiesel? Oh, it comes with a sound page. Roland TR909. Anybody still have one of those? Interesting ad. Andy Summers from the police. Hmm. Lexicon. Gibson, Gibson ad, Gibson uh, designer series. Interesting. Akai, Micro Studio System. Oh, is it cassette? What is that? No, it's a mixer. Polytone. I thought it was a Mesa, Mesa Boogie at first. All two bleed out. Hmm. Eddie Van Halen ad. Who still has the. Uh, pretty cool. Subscription thing. A jazz man finds the heart of rock and roll. Oh, okay. Guitar player from Hugh Lewis in the news. Aria. Remember Aria? Carlos Cavazzo. I remember when I first saw Quiet Riot was at the US Festival in 83. He did a guitar solo called Battle Axe. Man, it was pretty awesome. I was like, who is this guy? Really great guitar player. Oh, Gary Moore. Another awesome guitar player. Solid, man. This guy's... A solid player, one of the best. Awesome vibrato. Mesa Boogie ad. 
There's some back issues. I'm gonna go through this pretty quick. Gary Moore right there. That guy's passed away. Spinal Tap, funny movie. I still under understood why they were on the Hair and Aid. Remember when they did that thing for uh, Fight Hunger? It was a deal, Ronnie James deal put that together. Uh, they almost didn't fit in, but I, I don't know. It was weird. Because, you know, Spinal Tap is a spoof on heavy metal bands, and I don't know. It was just, I would have been irritated if these guys are standing next to me, and I'm trying to... Steve I. That's a young Steve I. Ooh, good article. I'm pretty sure I read it, but I have to read it again. Oh, what's this? Oh, what? Steve I, Attitude Song, Sound Page. Oh, wow. Look at that. I forgot this is even in here. Transcribed and everything. He did it himself. Wow, I wonder if this is worth anything. Look at this. this is you would play this on a rec a record player, and uh, this is before, I guess, uh, MP3 files and all that. Wow, that's cool. Awesome. I wonder if that's a collector's item. Another carving that missing persons. They must have had a big deal with Carvin because there's two ads of them already. Steve Stevens, he's good. I like that guy. DOD. Reader's Pole Ballot. Oh, wow. Oh, this is... That's pretty cool. Leave that right there. Oops. Another Kramer ad with Eddie Van Halen. Ooh, almost turned the page. Don't want to do that. There he is, Steve Ray Vaughan. Awesome, man. This guy is just incredible tone. The way he plays, bends the notes. Just, uh, I don't know. It blew me away. I was a fan after that watching that performance on Austin City Limits. I was like, who is this guy? I got to follow him. I even um, went and got my dad. I said, hey, come here. You got to check this guy out. Let's continue. Get some ads for guitar player. Yamaha guitars. Manny's music, everything for the musician. Well, that's a cool looking retro ad, huh? Are they still around, Manny's? The way things have changed nowadays? Let's go through this real quick. I gotta get going. El Dimiola, the best. Dawkins. They're still around. George Lynch, badass. Spotlight. Anybody recognize? Billy Squire. What happened to that guy? Am I in Europe? Hmm, interesting. Great. Phil Collin from Def Leppard. Lenny Brill. Herb Mickman. Rick Emmett. He was awesome. Well, he still is awesome. Vantage Avenger, Avenger guitar. Never heard of that. Interesting. Quite right. Tommy Tedesco.
Greg Chiquico, he's good. Starship. Good player. Excuse me. It's a big ad, huh? Two pages. Okay, we're coming down to the end of this issue of Guitar Player Magazine from 1984. I want to thank you guys and gals for check, checking out the YouTube channel. And I appreciate your support. Don't forget to subscribe and hit the like button. And uh, come back soon. Bye.